Welcome back <laughs> to my YouTube channel. It's another day, another video. Oh my god, I need to undo my hair. You know, all these problems are coming in because I haven't undone my hair. And yeah, so I look like I'm Corina today. <laughs> anyway, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's another day, another video. And today, this was actually abrupt. It's around uh, 3 p.m. And I have just decided to do an evening routine for, yeah, an evening routine as a mom of two and without a house help. Okay, so it's December season and we are letting our house helps go home for their holidays and everything. And I decided to do a, okay, mine hasn't left yet, but she's leaving on Saturday. So I need to practice what I'm supposed to do when she's gone. <laughs> Because I'm really freaking out. I haven't been alone with the two kids alone. And my hubby is traveling a lot nowadays because of one, two, three things. So I need to know how to survive alone. Okay, yeah. So basically, this is my evening routine without health help. And I'll also be making mandazis in this vlog. So yeah, so that's what one of the things we'll be doing I'll show you how to make soft, soft shortcake mandazis. And I say shortcake because they are they have stuff inside. It's not the mandazis that you open up and they blank inside. These ones are mandazis that they are cakey. Yeah, it's my kind of vibe and it's the ones that my son loves. So yeah, we'll be making those. And yeah, stay with me. I hope you enjoy this vlog. If this is your kind of content, home making, uh, chats, uh, real talks, um, recipes, uh, basically life. Welcome to my channel. Please don't forget to subscribe and like, comment. It helps my channel grow. And without further ado, let's get down to the video. Okay, so my evening routine starts around uh, 3-ish. That is when I stop working. So this is my workstation. <laughs> Girl, boss, don't. This thing is a DIY. And somebody was really, <laughs> I don't want to say mean, but <laughs> somebody told me to get real frames. This is the work of my hands and I'm proud of what I did. I know I was tight on money when I made this. This was made last year before i got pregnant and i forgot to mount them and when i saw them under the bed somewhere <laughs> in a box i decided to put them up but somebody okay maybe they are just wishing me well i'll get real frames is it frames frames yeah frames for photos so i was showing you my workstation this is my laptop over here my earphones because i either watch a movie on a screen at the side as i work and uh, yeah so either i'm watching youtube videos or i'm watching a movie right now i'm watching selling sunset season four yeah so, somebody pushed me to watch that i i feel like at the age that i am right now i am past watching reality shows no offense to those who love reality shows i just find them too scripted for me nowadays so i don't watch them but the hype selling sunset has gotten has just made me watch watch it so that's what i'm currently watching so i work half screen and watch on the other screen soft life 
<laughs> and yeah, this is my sister's water bottle, but I stole it and it's helping me keep hydrated. And my diary, it's where I note down stuff, maybe stuff that I need to do, like organize my vlogs, organize what I don't have in the house, stuff. I just write a lot nowadays. I find that my memory is not as good as it was some time back, so I have to write things down to remember. And yeah, so basically, I stop working at around 3. And that is the time I wash my baby. I am the one who wash my baby. My house self doesn't handle the baby. She handles every other activity in the house, mostly cleaning. Yeah, but kids, cooking, that's my kind of thing. Okay, so yeah, sometimes she helps be the older one, tie. On. <laughs> but I, I try a lot to be a present mom and to do stuff so i start my routine here i start my evening routine here at 3 p.m my older son comes from school at 3 30 so 3 34 ish so between 3 and 3 30 i wash my smaller baby my cat my cat baby my cat four months old so i bath him and then put him to sleep if that is what he wants at that time if he doesn't want to sleep i hold him for the rest until my other son comes from school but i most of the time he sleeps mm -hmm. so once he sleeps that is when i prepare the snack for the older one now that is what i'll be doing today to make mandazis and yeah i'll show you his timetable his evening snack timetable i hope i remember to do that it is somewhere there if i don't i'll attach a photo of the of the of the meal plan or what guides us on what he will eat in the evening and yeah so once that is done we usually go i'll where am i even narrating so I just show you <laughs> yeah so let's go prepare the mandazis so that we leave them ziki ziki what do we call them yo we rest the dough we leave the dough to rest as we wash as we bath the small cabbage so this is everything you need for your mandazis. I will tell you the amounts in a minute. So you need your all purpose flour. I'm using three glasses of this. So three, this glass is 100 grams, approximately 100 to 120 grams. So in total, this could be around 300 grams of the flour. And yeah, I wanted to show you the glass I used to measure because I don't have a scale. Then to this, you will add for every for every glass or for every 100 grams of flour, you add one teaspoon, one teaspoon of baking powder. So because you have three, you're going to add three. And this is just what I do. I'm not a professional chef. <laughs> every glass of every 100 grams you add one and a half spoons of sugar or depending on how you how much sugar you want so me i'll add four or five two three i think four is enough or four and a half <laughs> It's my balance after all. Yeah, so these are our dry ingredients, and then I will add our margarine. You can use butter, or yeah, you can use butter or any other brand of margarine like Prestige. So I'll use a tablespoonful. This actually makes the mandazi soft, so yeah, then. Then we mix, 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 mix. Uh, I'll use my hand. My hands are clean. Wondering if it's gonna feel like this forever. Wondering if it's gonna feel like this whenever she leaves her safe space. She leaves her safe space. Wondering if it is forever. Or is there some place that will make her feel better?
Same glass I used for so yeah. So this could be too much for my flour. <laughs> I think I should have used half, but we'll see. You can always add flour if it's too much, or we can then you can add this is about a teaspoon of vanilla essence. If you have the prestige margarine with vanilla essence, you don't have to add vanilla again. So yeah, that's our wet ingredients. And as usual, we dig up hole and start adding. You don't add everything. I have this feeling, feeling, haven't felt for so long. Took a hold of me and won't let go. I've been sleeping, caught me off my guard. Cause you're in my space and now I'm KPLC messed us up. So these are beans that my help had prepared earlier. I said she hasn't left yet, so that will have been me doing it. Ah. Ah. So I want to warm my baby's water to bath. And yeah, as that is going, I'll go and let's go pick clothes for him to wear today. So yeah. <laughs> Every 
canola <laughs> canola oil i don't like the flavor i don't like the way it has a distinct taste as in whatever flavor but i've run out of oil i use normally i use this this fresh fry that's what i use to fry my things but i've run out of it so yeah so we're going to use canola for today and then this is the dish that I'm going to put the mandazis in. And yeah, so here's my unga. That is my unga after one hour. More than one hour actually. And yep. So it's soft. Softer than it was when we put it. And you want it to stay for long so that the baking powder can integrate well in the vizuri. And yeah, so let's cook. So some people usually roll out the whole dough. dough. But I'll cut mine into pieces so that I can be able to regulate the thickness of my mandazis. I wanna be a weekend lover. Yeah, I'ma be the best damn lover you got. I wanna mess up your covers. Mama, 
ginę. 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 Moja gangka no. Eh. Ukoszuła. Moja gangka jest angapi. Kisa i kamo samik. Danganya. Nigwali. Moja gangka jest angapi. Hapu tu. Sija kono kienda po. Nenda tu. Nigwa. Kamo jenia ona. Sairan. Nenda jena. Eh, chaku danganya enda uwa gangka no. Ha, nima aga jena. Mama si nima aga. Nia zapa moko. So na dongo ni ni plants na na fruits. Plants ni plants. Uliamu aji leo kwenye ukwenda na fruits. Fruits ni kujenga ni. Sukuliza ni. Sukuliza. So at this point, Tai is out of school and I am about to finish. This is the last batch of the mandazis. So next, I'm going to bath him and. Yeah, then prep for supper and I think I don't want to make this vlog so long so <laughs> that's why I'm giving you a brief of what to expect and I hope you're enjoying it. If you are, please hit the subscribe button and yeah, like, share and comment. This is our final product. Ha ha ha. Oh, mandoze is Ooh. Amandazis, ahe. So right on time, Chai is out of school. <laughs> and Why are you lying to me? What did I lie? You don't have your phone and you have. I have my phone. Say hi. Hi. I'll get out to school. You have gotten out of school. Bye. 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 So, his water because KPLC Badu amacheza kama wow. We don't have steamer Badu. Mm-hmm. So, after taking a shower, this is what he'll have for his evening snack. This is our meal prep. This is what we have been using since November. I haven't put up the December one because, well, the girl has been lazy. So this is breakfast, but based on Tyran as he goes to school. The rest of us, we can follow. Like on pancake days, we follow. Most of the days, we follow what he eats, except maybe Saturday. But yeah, then... This is his evening snacks after he comes from school and then on the weekend this counts as lunch and this is everyone's supper so yeah so basically that's it I'll make a December one this is an outdated one <laughs> but yeah like today we were supposed to take a bowl of Wittles but then I, I have decided no so I cooked the mandazis so tomorrow with a bit blah 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 and yeah Picking Ty's outfit of the evening. Tavani Nila. Tavani. 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 Down, down, Satan. Up, up, God. Sasa neza kumeka aji self. Sasa shita na neza aji kuli vuko. Na mungo ali vuko. Nena meka aji self. Yeah, so next we usually do homework. So today we are a bit late in doing the homework because we had to go for printing. And he will just cut this out and stick them. As he do that, I will be cooking supper. Okay? Yeah, so I might help him. I might not. At this point, he already knows when he was in the previous class. That's when we used to do it together. But right now, I think he's more accurate. He knows what he's doing. And yeah, so his homework for today is types of plants. So what they do is they cut, they cut this, they cut out a single, single, single item and then use a sticky stick glue. So they will use a 
That's glue stick to stick them to a different paper so yeah so i'll just give him the plain papers and then he'll stick them he's not here now so yeah so this is how they turned out hi guys hi guys good job job good job i ended up helping him but okay also i'm also really really pissed at the printing place i sent someone to go and do printing and they printed them badly now look look at the oranges it didn't have yellow color look at the bananas <laughs> look at the papaya it's like anyway since it's it's late and you can't redo it at a pilagaivo you will explain to the teacher Mom, Mom, love mm -hmm. so it's much later in the evening and we are about to cook dinner so our dinner today is usually ugali spinach and beef ah, i know <laughs> yeah on friday we usually have ugali i've never even realized they are the same except for the protein anyway so Ugali, spinach and beef. I won't show you the cooking process because already we have cooked today. But basically, okay, let me show you the preparation for beef to get the softest beef ever. And my hands are so ashy. I need to take a shower and my ring was eating me up. See, see. So I took it off for a minute so that my finger can breathe. <laughs> yeah, so I'll be cooking beef today. If you haven't watched my pork recipe i think you need to watch it i think it's amazing and pretty simple and for my beef as well it's the same don't mind the lighting yeah <laughs> don't mind the lighting so yeah so for the beef you just put it in a spray let me show you i haven't defrosted it i was late to our fridge but yeah so ooh, so i'll add water until it's not really covered okay if it was a channeling a bit covered like halfway through and then to this water i will add some oil some cooking oil i still use canola for cooking so i usually use canola to cook food and yeah because it's really healthy but i don't like it for frying i had said that earlier but i usually use it for cooking normal foods so yeah so if you can please buy seed oil seed oil as opposed to what vegetable oil i'm not sure what i'm saying like if you can be able to buy canola oil sunflower oil coconut oil as opposed to buying vegetable oils i think that is way much better so once you add your water and your oil i think i put too much oil i'm not sure okay i don't think so but then in the camera it looks a lot but down here it doesn't so yeah i feel like this vlog is gonna be so long that is why i don't want to do specifics but you add your salt and then you cover then wait for all the water to dry you remember what we did with the pork all the water to dry but then once the water is done the mafuta and itabaki so when the oil remains it is start frying the meat and that is where you get the flavor okay so you wait for it to fry it fry it until you're sure it's dry fry and then now you put it aside in a bowl or something then you fry your onions you fry your tomatoes until they are paste then you put back your meat koroge and yeah you put your spices if you are into spices and you get the best meat anyway that's it for cooking today so yeah so as the beef cooks i will go take a shower wait i haven't been recording the whole time Shit. anyway <laughs> what i had been saying the whole time the camera was off is that i'm not shouting because my baby is still asleep so i was showing you the moisturizer that i am currently using for my face and i think i'll use it forever and ever and ever because it's amazing it's amazing man. it's amazing it's nivea cream and i was saying we were not buying it as a moisturizer actually my husband was buying it for himself 
and then i don't know what happened he stopped using it and i decided ah, let me just start you start using it and then recently now i have been seeing people especially those doing makeup so they use this as their base before they put the primer on and they have recommended it so many times i have seen like three four people recommend it and trust me it's the best moisturizer ever i don't usually have night cream sijui day cream sijui nini i just use it sometimes i use vaseline sometimes i use a remis just that village girl <laughs> anyway i'll see you soon as we eat supper or i think this is where i call it off we will see we'll see if i don't see you again see you in my next video but if i see you again well we'll do a closing remark when you see me then okay yeah so i'm from taking a shower and so as for my body i use this it's almost over it goes for 1000 bob it's the palmer's cocoa butter formula skin therapy oil and it has really made a huge difference since my pregnancy especially with the stretch marks my goodness anyway yeah so i just wanted to show you that real quick this is what i use for my especially my hips my waistline my tummy this is what i use for the rest i just use vaseline cocoa butter let me show you it's actually amara why did i think it was vaseline anyway i interchange between vaseline and this one but so long as it's cocoa butter for me i think that's all that matters i use cocoa butter a lot so this is what i use for my hands and feet and the rest of the body okay hands and feet these i use for my tummy the places that have stretch marks okay and the places i need them to recover so yeah so that's what i use in the process of helping this person homework i found my long 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 i, I don't know if you if you have watched my other christmas vlogs from not last was it last year no last year i didn't celebrate christmas in my house so i didn't do a lot but the year before that i did an advent cal calendar and i printed these ones i did a diy one i thought this year would afford to buy a supermarket one <laughs> lol if you don't work for an entire year and then you expect anyway that's not the point the point is i found these numbers and they motivated me to make an advent calendar so that will be my next vlog as we decorate our christmas tree maybe go for some christmas shopping so that's what i plan to do in the next video and i hope you will go with me okay so yeah so yeah this is how our dinner turned out yeah the the serving <laughs> is not me but no now you're getting mingi i'll probably eat two pieces yeah take it no i, I says you so i'll take like two pieces i love the other two pieces i'll eat at midnight because i'm still breastfeeding <laughs> yeah so yeah that's it for today i hope you enjoyed the vlog i'll see you in my next video please don't forget to subscribe like share and comment down below yeah so see you in my next video see you in my next video bye bye see you later oh bye. my god tom.